I want a painting of Lindsay to hang in my apartment. Ah, uh, you've got me speechless. I don't know if I should be worried or flattered or both. At this point, just make a whole shrine for me in your closet. My story is me and friends were walking to my house and then we saw something crash. We checked it out, we saw a random craft. Ooh, aliens. It was on fire, it scared me and friends. We saw three things with Megamind heads. Sorry, I'm just picturing Megamind. They reached for you guys and we ran away. A week later, we saw it again. I just need commas, sweetie. I am struggling to read this. The aliens grabbed my hand. Ooh, I had a pocket knife and stabbed it. Its blood was blue. We ran to my friends. We never went back on that trail. Do you guys think this story is real? Let me know in the comments below. You never know. I'm not gonna devaluate, invalidate, invalidate. I'm not gonna invalidate them. Maybe you really did witness a UFO crash. You went over, it grabbed your hand. Hey, maybe, maybe it was friendly. It was like, can we be friends? It grabbed your hand and you were like, hell no. <laughs> blue blood everywhere. I'm blue, I'm ready, daddy, daddy. My mom used to be neighbors with Jeffrey Dahmer. Holy snitcher doodles. Whoa. She is lucky and unlucky. Lucky because she didn't get harmed. Unlucky because close call. But I'm so glad you're safe. Hey everyone, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. My name is Lindsay Ivan. Today I will be reacting to some of the creepiest comments I have ever received. And if you guys want to see me react to other comments I've received, ba -ba -ba bam, I've done a bunch. There you go, here they are. Somewhere here is a link to the playlist um, and you can just watch them, go watch them. With that being said, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and obviously comment something down below because I read every single one of my comments. Yes, every single one. Now, let's continue on with the video. Keep watching. I died and was brought back to life in an ER due to a drug overdose. I'm clean now. When my heart stopped, I saw my nurse as an extremely tall female demon. Whoa. The walls were gray, stone, carved, crumbling arches with gates. They were barely holding back a huge amount of the most hideous demons. They were trying to get free and I knew that. If they did, they would torture and devour me. The nurse or the doctor brought me back then. It's hard to explain, but it was beyond terrifying. No, no, it, you don't have to explain. That sounds beyond terrifying. So I think uh, you were going to hell. And then the nurse saved your life, brought you back to life. So for those of you who don't know, hell has a bunch of demons behind a gate trying to devour and torture you. It does not sound like a good time. What are you talking about? I'm having a great time. Hey Lindsay, happy new year. Has anyone ever told you that you like a deer? Eh? Are you trying to say that I look like a deer? No, no one has asked me or told me that I like deer. I'm just imagining someone be like, Lindsay, you like deer, not cows, okay? You like deers from now on. No, that has never happened to me, but deers are cute. What's wrong with deers? Nothing, deer. I believe they saved the organs of mummies for possible cloning later on. Oh, here we go, conspiracy theory time. Ooh. The graves were all prepared for eventual cloning and even toys were saved. The pyramids contained everything the dead needed to be cloned and, uh, and continue their lives and often even had their servants in graves nearby. The theory was that they needed that in the afterlife, so in their graves or in their tombs, they gave them everything they needed for the afterlife food so that they don't get hungry on the way there, their, their guards to protect them and their servants to help them along the way, blah, 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 blah. They had no doubt they would be discovered by those who came from advanced civilizations, aliens, as they did and would be brought back to life. They were wrong. Instead, their graves were opened, their jars ruined and made unfit for cloning and all their belongings were spread out in different museums for us, uncivilized, oh, us, uncivilized people to stare at. So we could have cloned ancient pharaohs, but instead we're like, oh, let's open these canopic jars and take out their, oh boy, I sound like Mickey Mouse, <laughs> and take out their, their heart and destroy it. Oh boy. <laughs> this person thinks that ancient Egyptians thought that UFOs would clone them in the future. He seems pretty legit to me. He had a business card and everything. I, on Halloween, walked around with a plague doctor mask and an Adidas hoodie and got called Dr. Death. Ouch. Cool. I don't know why you were wearing an Adidas hoodie. You should have just completed the outfit and worn like a full on black Grim Reaper outfit or whatever they're called, you know? Rub. I live in the third world! I 
it's where a dead giraffe would be cut apart before its head hit the dirt and absolutely before the body got cold. Why are we yelling? I have no clue what video this was commented on or why this was relevant to the video or why this was commented. This person lives in a parallel world and then they're just going on about giraffes. But hey buddy, your favorite animal is no longer a giraffe, it's a deer. DEER! Did you know you got 666 by your head? Oh, it's probably this. You probably saw that and they're like, whoa, devil numbers. Oh, she's a devil worshiper. Witch, 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 witch. witch. Call me crazy, like you will. We didn't call you crazy yet. However, the Kentucky tornadoes was a UFO, were a UFO. Sorry, I should not correct people's grammar. Anyway, the tornadoes were UFO's warning of what is going on. I don't understand this. <laughs> the Kentucky tornadoes was a UFO's warning of more UFO's tornadoes and earthquakes and hurricanes to come and UFO's, UFO's, UFO's aliens. Attack is about to happen. Mass cities wide kidnapping. Humans is about to happen this year of two, two, 2022, two, 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 two. So that would have been February 2nd, and that did not happen. Or maybe it did happen. Who knows? Hi, Lindsay. When I was a child, I had two encounters with aliens. Oh, here we go again. I remember seeing lights rotating outside my bedroom window. I recall being lifted off my bed and being aboard some type of ship. I did see a few of them. They were tall and gray. I don't remember what their face looked like. I hope they don't come back. I hope they don't come back either for your sake and my sake, unless they're friendly. No, even if they're friendly, mm, mm. Better not. I don't know how I feel. They could like turn on us at any second. People would be like getting at the aliens as in like getting it on with the aliens. We'd have like human alien hybrids. I'm just not vibing with it right now. Paula, I feel like you're not vibing with a new vibe. After my abduction, abduction, I have been specking weird language. I somehow almost every time I am moving my fingers when I speak it. My all fingers was wounded after abduction. It took 1.5 months to recover them. <laughs> so this person got abducted by aliens and they no longer know how to speak English is what I have got from that. I understand what you're saying, baby. People actually have an own serial killer memorabilia. Yeah, those people are sick. Like they're glorifying serial killers. Like official letters, hair, whoa. Paintings, blood, whoa. A guy named Jake Weber, shout out to a YouTuber, Jakey Jake, if you wanna collab. You're never gonna see this video, but hit me up. Well, this dude owns memorabilia of different serial killers. Even owns a copy of John Wayne Gacy's painting of himself in some forest holding a bunch of balloons. Yeah, again, I don't know how I feel about that. First of all, I would think that all their memorabilia would be haunted and I'd be scared that they'd somehow come alive and murder me in, in my sleep. Second, we don't like glorifying serial killers. Some people have like a sick fascination. They're like, oh my God, Ted Bunny was so hot. I'm like, bro, he's actually insane. Have you ever seen Michael Peterson's, AKA Charles Bronson, AKA Charles Darley's work? He wasn't a murderer, but spent almost his entire life in prison because he kept taking inmates and officers hostage. He died in 2018. And the one thing that seemed to keep him level was his artwork. Check it out. I've never heard of this person in my life and they have so many nicknames, but Nico will search him for me and put facts up on the screen. We know she'll do that. My nephew, one night when I was living with my brother and his family, my 11 year old nephew had a dream of hell. He said that he seen a lake and people stand in lines and said he seen my brother, mouth sewn and hands cuffed. I'll never forget that night. They were crying and was, they were scared. I'd be crying and scared too. I hate nightmares. Hopefully this was just a nightmare and not like a premonition of the future. It's just a dream, it's just a dream, it's just a dream. And our final comment, let's see what we got. Better be a good one. I sharded, Mama Lindsay. <laughs> Okay, we're ending on that note. There's just some things that you keep to yourself. That's one of the things that you keep to yourself. Keep your own secrets. All right, guys, that's all the comments I'm shouting out for today's video. If you want to be featured in my next comment shout out, comment something down below. Keep it appropriate, please. <laughs> keep it appropriate. With that being said, while you're down there, smash that like button, obviously subscribe to my channel. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan. Stick around for some bloopers. Now, see ya, wanna see ya, bye. And if you guys want to watch, and if you guys want to watch, uh, here's a link to the, whoa, okay, we got another long one. That's what she said.
doe, a deer, a female deer. Rather live with Hades, honestly, from Percy Jackson. He's good looking. Oh my gosh, what's with all these UFO, like, conspiracy theorists all up in my comments?